Hmm, got a tragic here. Uh, this is just a little tool that I'm uh, going to upload to the workshop uh, for those who need it. Uh, it's mainly for my own needs because I got sick of rewriting it and I'm going to start uploading all my tools just so there's a backup online so I can quickly grab them. Basically what this does is just swap out objects with a temporary texture for hidden objects. So the way this works is this is just a normal custom object with a sort of crazy texture on it and when you hit swap with hidden it adds a transparent texture which makes it invisible but the object's still there. So I've got this set to an infinite uh, bag with some cubes in it and it's still there, it's just hidden. And by clicking this it'll unhide it. And this will, doesn't need names, it doesn't need anything like that, it just searches the entire scene for the hidden texture and then swaps the object texture with the unhidden one and vice versa. So, you know, and the reason I do this is because it really you can really make pretty mods using this technique. The problem is sometimes when things are hidden you'll move it or whatever, you'll lose the object and you've got to try and find it again and this tool just allows you to do it. So when I'm editing the mod I actually ha ha edit like this. So if I load up one of my mods like say Call of Cthulhu you can see this technique in action. So there's this pretty sort of token pile here and you can just drag tokens out of it. But it's just, it's actually, you know, if I, I actually just made a whole bunch of tokens or whatever in a big pile and then placed a hidden infinite bag under inside them. That's how I do that, do this token pile. Uh, you can see another version in my Alien Frontiers mod. So I have these token piles here and you can see I can just take items from them and they just look very pretty, sort of kind of like a, an actual game board. So if I just go to my tool and I just drag the tool in and I hit swap, you can see all the hidden objects pop up. So that, that's the infinite bag is there, the infinite bag is there. I've also got these sort of barriers to help people put their tokens in the right spot so like when they're dumping their tokens down here they uh, you know they they don't fall out they all they're all, they're all nice and contained so the technique I've, I used for a while instead of using snap points so people have freedom to place it anywhere but they still you know won't spill all over the spot yeah and it's just really really handy you just click on the button and it will hide or make things visible. So when you load the mod here, all you need to do is right click on the object and go custom and that's the diffuse map that you want. So you just copy that map, stick it on your own objects and then the hidden object will, will work. And that is that. Hidden object swap texture tool thing, yo. See you next time.